James, James Deacon. Well, I'll, I get a little bit of like morning sun coming from here and I don't want to lose any of the light in this place because what I love about it is how much light comes in. It's floor to ceiling glass and it's a corner unit, but sometimes in the summer it can really get hot so uh, the air conditioners have to work overtime. So I thought of installing some film to be able to just cut that heat down but not lose the light. I've been using um, LA tint um, on my cars before. I had my trailblazer done a long time ago and the smash proof tint and I thought well now they do home tinting I'll give it a try. Well I wanted to reduce the heat of the um, coming in but I didn't want to lose the light and that seemed to be the best recommendation from the LA uh, crew they were just saying well max of 70 would get you that exact thing that you're looking for so I'm looking to try that out see how that works. one is the infrared bulb mm -hmm. substitute as the sun so we can test the heat rejection of our film so if we put this glass with no tint mm. yeah yes. you can feel the, the heat here the max 70 with a higher heat rejection 98 to 99 percent heat rejection with 100 percent qb yeah i can feel it wow that's big okay. yeah yeah just going by the demo i'm really encouraged by the fact that you can cut that heat down a lot. So we tried the, the light and we tried the BTU machine to see how much heat gets through and so that seems to be the most encouraging part about it. That's what I'm really looking for in this whole apartment is to get that heat cut down but not lose any of the light. 